What is up guys, Austin Nurcho here and today we're unboxing the Star Wars Smugglers Bounty Box for this month and it is The Last Jedi. So of course we have The Last Jedi coming out next month and we won't have a box in so they're doing it now. And so I'm excited to see what we get out of here. So we have the ray on top of course. So let's see, this looks different. Is this a bandana? It's a new Funko item and it does look like a bandana. That's kind of neat and cool and it is a Star Wars and it's so flat. Last Jedi at least there's the new stuff because there's resistance troopers or uh, not resistance but uh, I forget whatever they're called. But uh, The New Order? Yeah the New Order. So we have Kylo Ren there and then the troopers there along that side. Then we have Kylo Ren's lightsaber, the new TIE Fighters and then it says Star Wars and everything. So that's really cool and this is a really like thick bandana so you can Obviously, wear a bandana if you do it this way and look at it the way I am. It looks 3D and it looks weird. Um, but that's really cool. And I did notice there's little, like, Star Destroyers in there. Like, those little diamond shapes and stuff. So, that's really cool. So, that's awesome. So, I do know they made bandanas, but that's kind of neat and cool. And then we also have some socks, it looks like. I thought it was a tie. But we have some socks, and it looks like it has... Um, I don't know exactly what's on it. Whether that's the... First order. I have no clue what this other shape is. It almost looks like the Praetorian Guard's faces, but I don't know exactly what they're supposed to be or not. I don't know that much to know if it's like the Resistance logo or what. I don't know. But there's some socks in there. I would say they're like dress socks, but they're kind of thick. They feel thicker at least than normal. But I don't know. So that's a. I like the design, but I have no clue what it is. I don't know that much about it. Uh, next up we have, ooh, we have a mystery mini thing. We have, so it looks like it's, you get a Luke. Either Luke in his, like, Jedi robes or the training Luke or whatever he's training Ray. So let's see which one we got out of here. Oh, the bag is already open too. Um, we have the training Luke. So we have Luke, he's got his walking stick there, which is really bent, but probably the way they have it attached. And then he's just in like some normal, like ratty looking clothes. He's got a backpack on with all sorts of stuff on a water bottle, stick, rope, all sorts of stuff there. And so that's, like I said, from I believe from the scenes where he's training Ray and stuff is what that all is. So that's kind of cool. And we got a mystery bubble head, even though it's not really a mystery. And then we also have a Ray Pop keychain. There, so we have Ray holding the Luke's lightsaber there when she's probably doing her training and stuff. So that looks cool. I've never seen these uh, keychains before, but that's cool that we got one of those. And then our pop for this month, which is pretty big, it is a Poe Dameron in a his uh, X-wing. So it's orangish color X-wing. So that's cool. Um, so let's go ahead and open this. Oh, it's got BB. For some reason, I thought saw BB and thought it was a porg. I was like, oh, they added a poor gun to it. Well, let's see this. Okay. Oh, this looks so cool. I love these pop rides so much. I think they're so cool. So it's cool that I just noticed the base is the um, whatever shape you call it, like hexagon shape, which is like what they do with the, the mystery minis and stuff. So I noticed they did that instead of just like a circle or some sort of thing. But there is Poe Dameron there with his head and everything and of course I like they make the bobble heads still but then their body's just stationary and they don't come out or anything and then we have a little tiny BB-8 which his head's not bald which is kind of surprising that it's not but um, he's just stuck back there I wish it would like turn and stuff at least but then we have the X-Wing so you can see all the sorts of detail they put into it and everything and I just like these so much because I like the way they make them float and everything they're cool like things to have like displayed and stuff but unfortunately, with in pop or in box collecting, it's kind of hard to do. But it just looks super cool. I really like that. So that is the Poe Dameron pop. And in case you didn't notice when I mentioned the thing about the Praetorian Guard, the red thing right there, it kind of looks like that face. Oh, this sucks. But that's it for the box. So once again, they didn't add any like papers. One to show what the next theme is, and then two to make sure we got all the items. But we did get a lot of different stuff. So um, I assume that's everything then. So that was. Um, so again, they're throwing in some new stuff, like experimenting with like more clothing and different accessory type stuff, like the bandana and everything. So the past couple month or two, they've been doing that, like adding new stuff and just the same old shirt pop. Uh, pin patch that sort of stuff they're actually kind of um, mixing it up and stuff and 
some of the items are cool. Some items I'm like, I don't know if I really want that or anything. But um, it's pretty cool and stuff, and I really, of course, enjoy the pops out of this, especially this pop right thing. But that's going to be it for this Smuggler's Bounty unboxing for this month. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, let me know in the comments down below. And don't forget to subscribe to see more videos. And we'll see you next time.